Welcome to www.learnquickbooksfree.com. That's right. This is where you get to learn QuickBooks for free. Hello, Jennifer, or may I call you Jen? All right, all right. So, got your question on September 12th. Today is the 19th. Sorry for getting back so late. Yes, I am on vacation. I'm doing this from a laptop on vacation. How cool is that? Anyways, back to your question. I received a refund from a supplier. How do I record this transaction? Let's go over to QuickBooks. I'm going to show you real quick because I got an appointment with the beach. So, over to QuickBooks. So, I'm in QuickBooks and I'm at the write checks part. And for example, this is the vendor that refunded you the money twelve hundred dollars for event expenses how do we record the transaction back it's actually quite simple you ready all right let's do it i'm going to go under banking i'm going to go to make deposits i'm going to get this little screen that pops up over here i'm going to choose which checking account i'm depositing the check i'm assuming it was a check refund um, so 919, I received it from vendor one. That's right. So we're receiving it back from the same vendor. And I'm going to choose it from the account event expenses because that's what I put it on when I paid it. So here we go. Event expenses. There it is. And then the rest is the rest. What was the amount? Uh, $1,200. Payment method could be check, whatever, so whatnot. Once again, $1,200. Saving you. Voila. Simple as that. I know it felt like, man, this is confusing. Where the hell is this at? But um, it's pretty much that simple. That's one way of doing it. Okay, if you paid uh, the vendor with credit card, then you would just go to credit card and do a credit. So, hope that answers your question, Jen. I hope you guys are having fun where you're out there because I sure am having fun over here. Once again, back to my vacation. See ya. And that concludes this lesson. Uh, you can visit our website at www.learnquickbooksfree.com to watch more videos.